Hi everybody! Welcome in my messy room right now. Um, I thought I'd make a video because right now I am 21 weeks pregnant and um, it's time for me to go and do things about this room because this is supposed to be the baby's room or it's going to be and right now it's, uh, it's a little bit messy. <laughs> Your girl has been busy. I'm a busy woman <laughs> and uh, I'm trying to change things and make this already a little bit into a nursery baby room uh, because I'm getting already a lot of stuff and I'm buying stuff myself and uh, right now I don't have a place to put anything. So bit by bit I want to prepare this room for the baby. Right now it's looking like this. We'll close the door. So yeah, we got some clutter and a closet that will go out of here. It will move to the kitchen and some stuff lying around. And actually we still need to uh, finish the flooring because we didn't do the sides yet. We are in this rented apartment right now because we sold our house and uh, right now we don't have another house. Uh, in mind yet so we are planning to move soon but we still don't know so we don't want to do a lot on this place just be able to live nicely really and it's uh, quite a small room I think it's let me see it's one two three four meters and uh, and one two three uh, wide so it's quite okay for a baby room I think could be smaller and then uh, it's looking out on the indoor balcony so I'll have to clean this <laughs> someday soon but you know life has been happening <laughs> but I have a lot of plants and stuff here and uh, you can open all these windows and stuff so I think it's quite nice for the baby to look out on the balcony and right here on the side we have a door to our bedroom so it's a nice connection between this room and our bedroom so yeah I thought it would be fun to keep track of this uh, room evolving uh, to a baby room and in the meanwhile I'm having fun while cleaning and organizing so plus plus okay time to do some general cleaning first <laughs> let's just do this I clean all of this and I still have some stuff lying around because I don't know what to do with it yet or it actually has to go to the basement like uh, this little drawer it has to go to the basement but I don't want to deal with it now and this is my box <laughs> full of yarn and stuff um, yeah I do a lot of crochet and knitting so I have a big box full of yarn. <laughs> I actually need to do more knitting and crochet because then this this box will empty a bit. <laughs> it's a bit too full. Uh, but that has to go to the basement as well someday. Then we have this closet, uh, which is a closet from the grandma from uh, my boyfriend. So um, we have this and it's nice for storage. But I don't know, I think with the other things we've chosen for the baby room, we have a gray, uh, how you call it, a gray closet and a gray drawer. 
thing uh, and the gray uh, bed. Uh, so I don't think it, this goes with it very well. And I think this room is small for all of it to fit in plus this closet. So this one has to move and it's going to move to the kitchen soon. But obviously I'm not going to do that on my own. <laughs> So we will do that later when uh, the stuff all arrives, when all the furniture arrives. It doesn't arrive anyway yet, so uh, it will arrive next month. So I'm very excited for that. Uh, and for now, this is storing all my camera stuff and uh, hobby stuff and that kind of things. So if that is gone, it will clear out this uh, corner. And then we got my actually diaper bag. This is my diaper bag, but we already used it without even having a baby because we went to Ibiza on holiday and we didn't have like a nice practical bag to take on for excursions and stuff. So I just said, mm, why don't we take this one? We can test it and it's actually very nice. It's a lot, lot of storage. And you can put bottles on the side with water, so we did. And we took this basically every day to the beach, so it's a bit filthy. And I have to clean it out because it has still the beach towels in it and <laughs> all kinds of holiday stuff. So I have to clean it out and it's, it's become quite dirty, so I'll have to put it in a washing machine as well. But I ordered another one. From this one because I like it so much. In the front it has space for bottles as well. You see you can put bottles over here. And on the side it has, we, we use this for water bottles but you can also put uh, the little baby towels in it and you can just get them from here. I think it's really nice. And on the other side as well but just for a bottle. And Inside it has a lot of storage as well. Maybe I will talk about it more later. I ordered another one. It's from AliExpress. So if you want to have a look, it is over there. Well, hello. <laughs> right now I think it's time to put in uh, the baby stuff I already have. I have a little crib uh, that we got from the family. It's like a family crib. It's going uh, through, uh, through the family who gets a baby. So everyone gets the crib <laughs> it's kind of nice so we got the crib as well and uh, I think later on we will use it next to the bed so uh, in the beginning we uh, have him on the side of the bed and I can just nurse him and sleep again um, but for now I will put it in his room uh, just to make this room a bit baby like and then I can put things in the crib from the baby so I can store it away um, yeah, so let's do that. <laughs> there we go. I think, I think in this corner. Ne, 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 ne. Cool. <laughs> Get off. Hey. Come on. <laughs> Let's see how this works. Oh, I guess I'll have to take it down again. Yes. And then just make a knot, I guess. And just it's okay. No, it's not. And where's the opening? Here we go. This way. It's kind of crooked. <laughs> there we go. Uh, it's kind of cute. Mm, the only thing. 
thing is that it's hanging on the floor, but it can't go higher up, so I'll just have to be happy with it. Mm. Like that, maybe? Yeah. I think it's actually kind of nice. Look, it's cute, right? I think so. It's a bit long for the hook thing because it can't go any higher, but hmm, well, I don't care. I might trim it someday. Oh, it's kind of cute. I got some stuffed animals from Disney. This <laughs> I got from my mom. It's uh, the rabbit from um, Bambi. I don't know how you call it in English. How does he call? Here it's called Stampertje. <laughs> and uh, we have uh, Bambi herself. And this is also Dutch, I believe. I don't think uh, other people have it. It's Nijntje. So now I'm going to put the stuff I already got in here. And in the meanwhile, show you some things. I got just things like sheets and stuff. I'll just put them in here randomly. And little towels. Then I got a few blankets. This one is from Boezel and Pip. <laughs> it's also Dutch. There we go. And this is actually pink. <laughs> Uh, this stuff I got from my sister-in-law. She got a boy and a girl, so she just gave me some stuff and uh, I'll have to look at what I'm using and what I'm not. A lot I will be using, but some things like this is pink and we found out we have a boy, so... <laughs> my, well, I think pink is good for boys and all. It's okay for boys to wear pink and stuff. I just think, um, I don't know, maybe I won't use this, so... I'll put that to the side and uh, stuff like this I got from her as well, like just cloths, <coughs> which are very, very nice to use. This one as well. So I'll definitely be using that. And this I crocheted. I will see. It's a rainbow. Woo! <laughs> So I crocheted this. If you want a pattern, you'll ask me. It's not my pattern, by the way. So I actually want to hang this up somewhere on the wall. Like, I don't know, maybe right there or something. But I'll have to nail it into the wall. So I will do that later. I'll put it in here anyway. Some changing covers and stuff, some wipes, uh, another sheet. Oh, then we got this one, which I like. I actually want the room to have a kind of a stars and moon the theme. Um, so a kind of night theme with uh, blue and stars and a moon before we actually knew it was a boy i already wanted this like grayish blue type washed out blue type of color because i think it fits with pink i think it fits with all and i don't think we are going to paint these walls because we're renting and we actually want to get out of here so i think it would be nice and light with just the white and then this and then the gray furniture that we got and but now since it's a boy there won't be any pink coming in uh, we will use other colors though. So I'm sticking with the stars and the moon theme. And I got this uh, nice little blanket. It's like a fleece blanket with a lot of shiny stars and moons. I really like it. So we'll be using that. And the baby is born in the winter, in November probably. So it's nice and warm for him oh this i got from my sister-in-law as well it's a tiny little robe which i think is super cute it's like a shark 
scared. <laughs> I think it's cute. So that will go in a closet later, but since I don't have one yet, it's going in here. And clots from Dumbo from Disney. And what's this? I actually don't know. Oh, this is a little blanket with panda bears. I like it. And we got some flamingos. Uh, this cloth actually is stars and moons as well. It's very coincidental. And then we have, I got from her as well, this one with little clouds. It's very cute. Also fits with the team, so <laughs> got lucky. Some more clothes. Oh, and then some clothes I already got because I know, I think it's cute. Um, I went thrifting the other day and I found some little rompers and clothes, which I thought were cute and really small. So they might come in handy. They might not, but we'll see. Um, I got this one says I love grandma so of course I had to have it because grandma is going to be wild <laughs> about this baby because uh, this is the first grandson for my parents and for my boyfriend's parents it's already the third so it's a, a bit more special for my parents and then I got this one which I just thought was really dry humor it's just a, a tiger yeah a tiger and it says <laughs> I thought it's funny and then when I saw the I love grandma I also saw the I love grandpa so <laughs> I had to have it and some little pants some little grey jogging kind of pants really cute and I got it all for like 3 euros so it was really cheap Then I got some other things just at the normal store. Just a little romper, just white basic. And, oh, another one. <laughs> and this little outfit I got from my, uh, my parents-in-law, <laughs> my mother and father-in-law. It's this little cute pants in an orange kind of color. I really like it with together with this this little shirt with little tiger panthers on it so we got this before she knew uh, that we were having a boy so it's kind of a neutral I think it fits for both so that's great and then the other day I was in the store and I saw this little cute linen pants <laughs> It's way too big for now or anytime soon. It will be for next year. But I think it's so cute and it was on sale, so couldn't resist. And it has a little sun on the back. I think it's really, really nice. And also the father from the baby <coughs> has this kind of pants as well. So it will be extra cute. <coughs> Sorry, when they wear them together. So that's the kind of clothes stuff. Let me see if I have more. Yeah, here I have more. This is a little toy. <laughs> I thrift it as well and I clean it all and stuff. So it's now good to go. And I got these hooks for my stroller, which I think will be very nice. They go on the handle from the stroller. And then you can hang all kinds of stuff on it. So we'll call in handy. I got some more cloths because I heard you never can have enough. So <laughs> I leave them. And then we got some towels, some over the head cape towels. More cloths. <laughs> oh, 
Oh, and we got this amazingly funny, I think it's very funny, monkey from the drifting store as well. I already watched him, but he's looking a bit uh, wrecked up anyway. But I thought his eyes were so cute. He's like, I'm eating this banana. <laughs> it's kind of cool. And if the baby doesn't like it, I like it. So <laughs> I'll take it to my bed. <laughs> Some more sheets and then we got the cutest tiny shoes ever <laughs> look <laughs> they are really cute little vans I love them because I have vans as well <laughs> you see mine are really really filthy and I need new ones but how cute love them Okay, I'll just go through this really quickly because this is becoming a video that's really, really long. Uh, another blanket. A thermometer. You also need. So, some more towels. And I think that was actually it. I think that's it for the video for today because I can't do anything else in this room for now uh, we'll have to wait for the furniture to arrive and then uh, we'll see what we can do more and then we can actually store all this stuff in the closet and the drawers so that would be nice and i am so excited for my stroller i think it's a really cool one so anyway i hope you liked watching and i'll probably see you later bye